Rachel Steife, and I'm here with Saddleback Church's HIV AIDS Initiative. And we're here at the International AIDS Conference 2014 in Melbourne, Australia. We're here offering compassion and community and real solutions to thousands of people here at the conference. We empower local churches all around the world to start caring for people living with HIV and AIDS in their community. And we have a church strategy, C-H-U-R-C-H. Earlier this week, we talked about how the church can care for and support the sick. And H, handle HIV testing and counseling. The third thing is U, unleash a volunteer labor force. The church has over 2 billion believers all around the world. And there are more than enough people to care for those living with HIV and AIDS. You could go into a remote village and there might not be any running water or a postal service, but there is a church. And so we believe that if ordinary believers were empowered to care for those in their community living with HIV and AIDS, this pandemic would cease to exist. Local churches across the globe are an enormous pool of untapped resources, of talent, of energy, and of compassion. What an impact we could make if local churches started showing up and caring for those living with HIV and AIDS. Some might ask, why work with a local church? And there are seven reasons why the local church is the hope of the world. First, the local church has the largest participation. Over 2.1 billion believers name the name of Jesus. The church has the widest distribution. The church is truly the most global organization. Churches are everywhere. The church has the simplest administration. The local church is made up of grassroots networks that is extremely efficient and fast. The church has the fastest proliferation. HIV grows at a rate of 6,000 new infections every day, but the local church grows and multiplies by 60,000 new believers every day. The church has the longest continuation. The church has been here for over 2,000 years. No organization or government can even come close to that. The church has the strongest authorization. Jesus Christ created the church and he gave us the authority to go out and do good works. And finally, the church has the highest motivation. The church has the highest motivation because Jesus Christ commanded us to go out and love others. Those are the seven advantages to utilizing the local church. Stay tuned later this week to find out more about how your church can help care for those living with HIV and AIDS in your community.